The House will be in session. Prayer will be offered today by our guest chaplain, Rabbi Joshua Gruenberg, Congregation Beth L. Yardley, Yardley, Pennsylvania. Our God and God of our ancestors, everlasting spirit of the universe, may it be your will that the members of this house faithfully represent all citizens of this great nation. As they strive to govern this land, guide them, O Lord, with the pillars of humility and respect. Help them to live up to the legacy of those who have come before and to always honor those men and women who have made the ultimate sacrifice to keep this nation strong and free. Remind all citizens of our great nation to put people over politics, to elevate democracy over dogma, to value discussion over discord, and to cultivate compromise instead of convictions. Bless the members of this hallowed body with the knowledge that what binds us together is stronger than what may pull us apart, that serving you is best accomplished by serving others. Dear God, please allow your blessing of health and of peace to envelop our great nation. Amen. The chair has examined the journal of the last day's proceedings and announces to the House his approval thereof. Pursuant to Clause 1 of Rule 1, the journal stands approved. Mr. Speaker. For what purpose does the gentleman from Texas rise? Mr. Speaker, pursuant to Clause 1 of Rule 1, I demand a vote on agreeing to the Speaker's approval of the journal. Questions on agreeing to the Speaker's approval of the journal. Those in favor indicate by saying aye. Those opposed, no. Opinion of the Chair, the ayes have it. The journal stands approved. The Mr. gentleman Speaker. from Texas. Mr. Speaker, I object to the vote on the grounds that a quorum is not present and make the point of order that a quorum is not present. Pursuant to Clause 8 of Rule 20, further proceedings on this question are postponed. Pledge of Allegiance today will be led by the gentlelady from Missouri, Ms. Wagner. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I invite everyone in the gallery to please join us in the Pledge of Allegiance. Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Without objection, the gentleman from Pennsylvania, Mr. Fitzpatrick, is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to honor and introduce a good friend and community leader in my home district, Rabbi Joshua Grunberg, and to thank him for offering today's invocation. Rabbi Grunberg made the trip here to the nation's capital with his wife, Alyssa, and his two children, Kayla and Samuel. I'm proud and pleased to welcome the rabbi and his family to the House of Representatives. Rabbi Grunberg is the chief spiritual leader at Temple Bethel in Yardley, Pennsylvania. Since he joined the temple in 2011, I've gotten to know the rabbi quite well. He's participated in several of my local roundtable discussions on issues, including Israel and the Middle East, and has come down to Washington to visit with me and offer counsel. Rabbi Grunberg is a warm and welcoming Bucks County leader. He's helped build on a strong foundation at Temple Bethel that will last for decades to come. I'm proud of the work he's done in our community and privileged to call him my friend. Mr. Speaker, I yield back. The chair lays before the House. Uh